First Lady, Dr. Jill Biden, the Biden family joining them on stage. As we wrap up our coverage this evening, I'm going to get some reflections here from our panel. We're joined, as we have been all night, by Judy Woodruff, Amy Walter, David Brooks, and Jonathan Capehart. We'll start with you, Judy. Your reflections on what we heard from the, from the well, president this evening. An extraordinary moment in America's life, uh, American history. The first time we've seen a president step away at a moment at a, this late in a campaign, turn it over to his vice president. There was emotion. This, the, the, the room was shaking. I think it was one of the longest, loudest ovations I've seen for anybody at a political convention. Uh, thanking Joe Biden for this gesture that he made. Yes, he was pressed. He was pressured. But he did, he did step aside. He turned it over to his, uh, his vice president. And this is a Democratic Party that's very grateful to him for doing that because most of the people in this room were worried that if he was on the ballot, that they were going to go down uh, to a loss. And so you see that gratitude, um, and you hear it from this group. And I think the line that we're going to remember, I'll be the best volunteer, Kamala and Tim ever had, and the other line, let's put a prosecutor in the Oval Office rather than a convicted felon. Yeah. And even we also heard him say that he harbors no ill will toward those Democrats who demanded he drop out of the race. The president said, I love the job, but I love my country more. Yeah, and l listen, he spent a lot of time, though, talking about his accomplishments as a way, uh, again, he wasn't saying I, I hold a brush of them, but he's saying, I'm going to use my time that I've been giving to to remind all of those who were doubters of mine about the accomplishments that this administration uh, has been able to put through under my leadership. Uh, and to me, you know, the, the, his ending here where he says, America, I gave my best to you, is basically his way of saying as much as he can about this bittersweet moment uh, in the arc of his career. Jonathan, 